and we're here with Christina on the red carpet to talk uh, about Halloween. Um, how was it being in the remake of a kind of one of the most iconic horror films ever? Um, well, it was amazing. It was an honor, and it was like definitely some big shoes to fill for sure. Uh, as you know, you know, PJ Souls is amazing. She played the original Linda, and um, I loved. Uh, you know, it was it was almost scary to work with Rob Zombie at first because I, you know, he's like the bigger than life character, um, and but he was so easy to work with, and he was so cool. And the the movie was probably still one of my favorite experiences to this day. Like just great. Uh, do you do you do a lot of horror, or was this a new new thing? for you. Halloween was the first horror movie I ever did, and I did not used to ever watch horror movies. Um, they freaked the shit out of me. Um, I watched, uh, you know, Nightmare on Elm Street on, um, on Elm Street, and I couldn't sleep afterwards. So, uh, actually, Halloween pushed me into the into the horror genre, and I started to do more horror movies. And also, so now all I do is watch horror movies because they're all directed by my friends. So I get really excited. I'm like, yeah, you know, um, I don't know, like you know, just you meet people at festivals and you get you get their movies and you watch them, that's all I watch them. So. Well, uh, for, for our blog, we do a kind of a history of horror each week. We do a, a new, uh, we started back in the silent films and black and white, and uh, we're working our way up, we're coming up to Halloween, and one of the things that's... The original or the remake? The original, but okay. we're going we're gonna, to we're gonna double team them, okay. so we'll be seeing your work. Double teaming now, jeez. <laughs> I didn't know what I was getting into here. This is horror. <laughs> oh, I know. <laughs> so... Uh, do you do you uh, look f do you look forward to doing more horror? Is that something you you actively want to pursue? Um, actually, so I went to directing school. I went to NYU to get my master's in directing, and I would like to direct um, horror. Like my first feature, I want to direct a horror movie. Um, I, I like acting in horror movies, but they've just the part has got to be something more substantial than like a victim. So I've been really lucky. I played great parts. Um, you know, in Chill Rama, I played Eva Braun, and I got to. Um, um, you know, although Proxy is not a horror movie, it's a thriller. I got to play like a great character in that, like a character that people would like die to play. Um, I've been really lucky, and, and so, but I would like to direct horror, and um, that's more my focus right now, and, and act more in um, like comedies and TV stuff. <laughs> I gotta, I gotta like rest the soul sometimes, you know. <laughs> Completely understood. Now uh, there are so many different types of horror. Which is your favorite, and which kind of specific genre of horror would you like to direct? Um, okay, well, definitely like psychological thriller, go more ghost stories based in um, tradition and based in like what people are scared of, like nature. I love I love nature and what's scary in nature, if, whether it's animals or like my my first short just got picked up by Fearnet, but then Fearnet, you know, crashed. So um, it was it's kind of about I like messed up humans co with, in conflict with nature and like what uh, spirits or I don't know uh, there's a script that I'm thinking about right now but I don't really want to talk about it so <laughs> um, but I definitely not like definitely not a monster that's not probably what I would do best I think more psychological thriller ghost story well horror movies have always kind of evoked the fears of the time and what you're talking about sounds exactly kind of the current climate and fears of society um, so I think you're spot on with that. yeah or like apocalyptic stuff like that is fascinates me too you know what's gonna happen in a hundred years or you know what are we going to be are we gonna be like half human or half robot or I mean they, they're definitely moving towards that I don't know if it's ever gonna happen but um, you know, just, just let your fantasy run wild on that one. <laughs> um, besides the script you're working on and pursuing the directing, are there any projects right now that you've got coming up that you just want to let the world know about and pl yeah. plug away? Well, I really, really want everybody to see Prox Proxy, P-R-O-X-Y, directed by Zach Parker. It, it premiered in Toronto last year um, in the Vanguard section. It's been, it got like amazing reviews and variety in New York Times and LA Times, and it's on iTunes tunes right now but it's going to be coming to DVD this summer and um, it's all over your VOD so <laughs> just look for it put it on uh, put it on on rent on your Netflix it's not on Netflix yet but if you enough people put it you know click that button that you want to see it it'll come soon enough 
Fantastic. So that's uh, Proxy. Look for it on Netflix, iTunes, and uh, we'll definitely put a link to it up with, uh, oh, with this. Go and visit my Twitter, people. I need more Twitter followers. What, what's your Twitter handle? It's at Christina Kleeb, uh, K-R-I-S-T-I-N-A-K-L-E-B-E. There you go. Uh, so subscribe. We'll put a link to that as well. And have a wonderful night. And Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> Bye.